All right, ladies and gentlemen, we are going to spin again. We are going to try to win a match with Happily Ever After with the Niv-Mizzet deck. Um, our last game was against Soul Sisters, which, considering the card you want to win with, gives them a huge amount of life with a bad shirt. So hopefully this time we can find a matchup where gaining life might be relevant. All right, so this is a keep, I think, because we have Ramp and Mana Dork. I think we we'll start with Tapland first, though, and see what our opponent is. First turn Fortsies, because that's the new historic format. Oh, no, there might just actually be some kind of... Alright, so we'll drop a Goose. We'll drop this. So, if they don't kill the goose, we can drop an early merriment, which can just run away with the game. But we really need to see what they're doing. Okay, so he's not doing anything too particular. Alright, so what we'll do is we'll drop Domri as a tester. What a glorious day for Savannah. The only authority that I recognize is K. Alright, so he didn't do anything. So now we could potentially Niv if he doesn't kill Domri or the Goose. Oh, he's Grixus. Narset, Grixus. Okay, so he's Narseted. Saw it coming. Alright, so he does have counter spells. Well, Domri can counter anything he plays here, so let's. We can't do double white because we don't have it. So let's play this. Tamiyo's great to stop the discard effects that he'll undoubtedly run. We'll drop the merriment into battle. Then we'll put another... We won't answer the Alright, so that's pretty solid here. So... I'm pretty sure Grixis doesn't have too many ways to deal with enchantments. It does have the new toy from... Uh, uh, what's it called? Zendikar Rising. Um, the Swarm Feeder or whatever it is. I've been seeing it a lot in Commander. So he's probably just going to foretell and hope for a counter spell. Oh, nope. He's just going to go for the uh, straight up murder Domri. And see what he gets from this. He gets Chandra. Alright, cool. So we'll just kill Narset with a merriment a token. I can see. We will play. I am Tamiya. It is an honor to meet you. Let's. That'll be funny. Let's go for. Let me aid your oh, I would need to learn to spell. Let's just go for happily ever after. Nope, it's just four lands. We can get a black though, which could be very relevant if we want to drop the uh, Niv. At the same time, we may need to drop the. Uh... Oh yeah, he's going to take Niv. Oh, I'm going to. Oops, <laughs> because Tamio says no discardies. <laughs> uh, I need to run Tamio in modern to see if I can get some modern players with that for fun, <laughs> or Pioneer. Alright, he's going to keep up the counter spell, which is totally fine with me. Because what I'm going to do is attack with both of these. Then I'm going to minus. I'm going to put Domri in my hand. No tail should be discarded. I'm going to play Domri to bait out the counter spell. That's fine with me. So his next turn is probably going to be Chandra minus to wipe my board. Yep. Or Chandra to kill Tamiya. No, he's just no trying pressure. to give me... Okay, well, here's what's going to happen. I'm going to minus Tamiya again, get back over Grand Tomb. 
which is my black source. And then I'm gonna pay my nerve. And I only hit one card after the whole NIV, which is great. Uh, three, six, we'll just go straight at your face, it doesn't matter. Literally, like, I don't think it matters here, because you can minus your Chandra to wipe everything but NIV. Then you'd have to kill NIV. And he knows that I have the Oath of Kaya, so there's like... A million things here that kill him. Yep, there's the two drop that kills him. So let's just drop off of Kaya. And then attack him directly. And kill him. Yep. So Happily Ever After didn't show in this game, and we had possibly one of the worst nibs I've ever seen. Um. So this is a control matchup, so Clarions are pretty pointless here. We're going to probably win with a Merriment thing. So Forty Ratios are pretty good. Golos is great. Time Wipe is kind of irrelevant, I think. So we can bring in an Unmoored Ego. I'm going to guess God Pharaoh is in this deck, because that's usually what Grixis goes for, is that win con. Uh, yeah, we'll try it like this. Man, static abilities on Planeswalkers are so busted in a funny way. So many people just don't remember that they exist. Or only remember like the really relevant ones like Narset. I mean, I've played so much against Narset since War of the Spark, but I still make that mistake in some formats, where I forget Narset's out and I try to cast a spell or a cantrip. Alright, waiting on the opponent. What are they going for? <laughs> oh, okay. Wow. Alright, so there's going to be a turn one Fort Seize, so this will be funny, because they will turn one Fort Seize us. Oh, I now feel quite stupid. Alright, so let's think, make them think that we're racing towards something here, because this could prompt them to either hold up counters or try to deal with the goose. Is he going to kill the goose? No, he's just going to fall erasure. Take the Niv. Totally fine with that. And he keeps it on top. <laughs> Better lucky than good. Play another Niv. I'm assuming though, since you gave me another Niv, he's holding another Forties. Or you might just drop a Narset. What's this? Non land permanent cards in graveyards and libraries can't enter the battlefield. Okay, that's totally fine. So I'm just going to play this ramped out and then I'm going to just cast a Niv off the top. Because I really hope there's not a one mana counter spell now currently in Historic. They're not entering the battlefield, they're coming to my hand. It's a different thing. It's one of the things that uh, gets around Narset as well, because <laughs> they don't. Uh, I don't draw the cards. Yeah, he's checking it now. Oh, I will take the action, my friend. So I'm gonna play this. I'm gonna growth spiral while I'm on, because this means he's gonna forever have to hold up a counter spell. Which I'm sure he's holding up here. We will get... Wait, what do we need? Yeah, we'll get another white, just for the sake of it. And then we'll make a food. Alright, so he's got to have a counter spell here. So this will be two mana. Well, let's do this. Oh, he did not have a counter spell. My guess is he must have a uh, 
another effect to deal with this. So let's see what he drops here, because it will probably eat my uh, Assassin's Trophy. If it's a scary ass planeswalker like a, a Dragon God. No, just an extinction event. That's fine. We'll make a food because we want to hold things here. Alright, so he is tapped out. So we got one, two. So if we drop this. Yeah, we can do both. So let's drop the merriment. Then we'll forward erasure. I am stupid because I do not have that card. What we will do though is we'll hold up Assassin's Trophy for whatever Planeswalker he tries to play here. And if it's Chandra it'll just be easy enough. Alright, so it's uh Sword coming, I'm guessing. Alright, so let's forward erase you then for fun. Four tail cards we can't interact with, so he's going to have the counter spell, regardless. Angus Rampage. Yeah, we'll get rid of the Dragon God. <laughs> We've drawn all four of our Niv Mizzets, man. He's going to be so pissed. So, let's. If that's a counter spell. Let's go to combat. Okay, so assuming that's a counter spell, we probably just want to drop this. No, wait, if we drop that, we can't hold up that. So we'll do this. And then we'll drop an Oath of Kaya, just for the hell of it. So we can either bait out this counter. So he has to start killing our creatures now. Because this just snowballs now. We hit another warrior. Oh yeah, he's going to be pissed when he sees our hand. <laughs> All four Niv Mizzets. Oh, he takes the Golas. Well, this is a problem now because... Even if you counter... Yeah, he doesn't want to land. He wants a relevant spell. Yeah, those moments just can run away with it when we run into control matches. So, I apologise, this has not been a happily ever after game. But I think you'll know with, like, ultimate win decks, you have to have a backup plan. Like, that's why the Maze's End decks now run the uh, Maze package from the new Ravnica. Ba bump Woo! Well, we might as well play into your counter here, because we've still got the Assassin's Trophy for whatever you play afterwards, so you might as well use that last counter you got. Yep, there's your counter spell. You know I have one more Niv in hand, but it's also the merriment that's going to kill you, mate. You probably have to board wipe here to stay alive. Yeah, that's not going to help you. Focused and disciplined. Encounter no, but thoughtfulness before action. I mean, Aoife as well probably would save him. Yeah, you just die here, mate. Yep. Well, that was not a happily ever after game, but it, it was a game. 